on my way to my local sawmill to pick up all of the materials for this project. I was already there earlier this week, but I got about three quarters of the way through my project and my SD card corrupted and I lost all of the files, which definitely sucks, but it's not the worst thing in the world. The first time I built the table, it was really a learning experience. I remember thinking while I was building it, all the things I would do different if I built it a second time. So now I get to try all those things out. It's a universally fitting wood shaping and power carving blade that attaches to your angle grinder. You can use it to flatten out large surfaces like I did on my tabletop, or you can hold it at an angle and really contour and shape and sculpt wood. I've been really wanting to try out the turbo plane for a while, so when Arbitech got in contact with me, I was so excited to be able to work together with them. Now I'm gonna leave a link in the description so you can check out the turbo plane along with all of the other awesome products that they make, and I'll also be giving one of these away, so make sure and stick around to the end of the video so you can find out more about that. Victor Axe and Tool sent me a couple tins of this wax to try out. Now it looks 
and smells just like paste wax. So I'm assuming even though it's titled metal wax, it'll be fine for wood. The whole reason I'm going with a wax finish instead of a water-based or an oil-based polyurethane is because I can tell that the wood has a relatively high moisture content still. It's not completely dry. If one of these cracks get bigger, I want a finish that I can remove really easily, put a butterfly or a bow tie in to stop the crack from getting bigger, and then put some finish over it and be able to blend it really well. So I think this is gonna work perfect. this piece. I think it looks amazing and it's definitely one of the best looking things I've made. I want to give a really big thanks to Caleb Woodard who is a really amazing furniture and lighting designer. He builds tables really similar to this that are called mercury tables and it was the main inspiration for this piece. I've been following his work for the past couple years now. He was one of the big inspirations on me getting into building furniture so it's really awesome that I was able to build a piece that was inspired by him. Caleb, if you're watching this, I want to say thank you very much. You've been a really big inspiration on me building furniture, so thank you. I also want to give a really big thanks to Arbor Tech for sponsoring this content and giving me the opportunity to try out the Turboplane. Like I said earlier, I'll leave links to the Turboplane as well as Arbor Tech's Instagram and website. Also, earlier in the video, I said I would be giving away a Turboplane, which I am. Arbor Tech was nice enough to send me an extra Turboplane to give away to one of you guys watching. So, all you have to do to be entered into this drawing is go to my Instagram, find the picture of this, click like, make sure you're following my Instagram account as well as ArborTech's Instagram account. And Tuesday next week, I'll be randomly selecting one of the people that liked that picture. So thanks again, everybody, for watching. If this is your first time on my channel, I'd like to say welcome, as well as please consider subscribing. All you gotta do is click that button right there, and you'll be updated every time I put out a new project video, which I try and do every week. If you enjoyed this video, make sure and hit that like button, and if you have any questions or comments, be sure to leave those below. If you wanna watch another one of my videos, there's one right here, and we'll see you next time on Modern Builds.